3,000 registered voters in Alabama just got booted from the state voter rolls. That's after the Secretary of State, Wes Allen, ordered the removal of all non-citizens who were registered. But how did non-citizens get registered in the first place? WAFF 48's Nick Ballinger spoke to the Secretary of State to get to the bottom of this story. Nick? Yeah, Margo, when I asked Secretary Allen how these people got registered to vote in the first place, he couldn't give me a clear answer just yet, saying it was still being investigated. But when he gave me a breakdown of how many there were in each county, the numbers were glaring. This is a list from Secretary of State Wes Allen of how many non-citizens were registered to vote in our counties. The state found 3,251 people. 742 of them were from North Alabama. We got the information. We cross-checked it against our uh, centralized data file here in the state of Alabama and found those 3,200 individuals. The information he's talking about are people with alien registration numbers. Those are issued to immigrants who intend to live in this country permanently and have already applied for a green card. However, you're not eligible to vote with just an alien identification number. When I asked Alan how 3,000 plus were able to register in the first place, he couldn't give me the answer. But it's our belief that only American citizens should be allowed to vote. Uh, Non-citizens, whether they're legal or illegal immigrants, cannot register to vote. It's a federal offense. To vote here.